What is up guys this is Tiro back with another video on the Redmi Note 7 Pro and today in this video I'm going to be showing you how to install the 11th May 2019 Havoc OS on the Redmi Note 7 Pro. Well I would say if you are switching from MIUI you have to follow this process and if you are not if you are on a custom ROM just make sure you wipe everything like the cache, Dalvik system, data and vendor then just flash the like vendor image and you will find that video which I have shown like in the pixel experience ROM flashing video in the cards right here. So just follow that video like while flashing the vendor like the stock vendor. But if you're coming from stock MIUI then you don't need to like do anything just flash the ROM and the other stuff that I'm going to show you today in this video. So first of all let me show you which files that I'm going to use over here. Here as you can see we have the Havoc OS zip file this is the 11th May 2019 zip by the way and we have the mount system for the gapps and we have the fcrypt disabler to like keep the twrp recovery so right now let me just reboot to recovery so i have successfully booted into the twrp recovery now let me just go to wipe but before that make sure you do have a backup of everything on a pc or something and if anything goes wrong in like some case just go to wipe now when you have backed up everything then advanced wipe then just wipe Dolby cache system and data. I am guessing that you have the stock vendor not the modified vendor but if you have the modified vendor just wipe the vendor and install the vendor with that video again and right now I have the stock vendor installed so I'm not gonna wipe it. So right now I'm gonna just wipe Dolby cache system and data these four things just swipe to wipe. Once that's done go home go to install. Now let's go to the like download folder wherever your files are here as you can see we have all the files we need four files here because i am not gonna flash the vendor again i'm mentioning it again and again because you need to be on the stock vendor for this havoc os and all the roms coming up like next like pretty sure they will be coming with the stock vendor like they will support the stock vendor you don't need modified vendor for like future custom roms and right now just select the rom file over here at first once you have done selected the like ROM file, then just add more zip, then select the mount system like violet. This is for the G apps to flash open G apps. You need this zip. Just like tap on add more zip again. Then select the G apps you need. Like you have downloaded earlier. I have downloaded ERM64 9.0 micro G apps. And now add more zip again. Then select the F script disabler. This is for like to keep TWP recovery on your device on the stock vendor. So now just swipe to confirm flash and wait for the time being. So right now the flashing procedure is done. Let me just hit reboot system. So here as you can see we are successfully booting up into the Havoc OS and this is the boot animation of the Havoc OS. So I think we have successfully booted like we will successfully be booted in the Havoc OS. So that is how you can flash Havoc OS on the Redmi Note 7 Pro, the latest build which is based on the stock vendor. So give this video a thumbs up if it helped you and subscribe to the channel down there if you have not yet. Share this video out with your friends if you want them to know that how to flash Havoc OS on the Redmi Note 7 Pro. And I'll just set up this ROM and I'll definitely try to do a full review of this latest Havoc OS on the Redmi Note 7 Pro pretty soon and just like stay tuned for that. This is Tito from KDN Tech signing off for today. I'll be catching you guys in the next one. Bye-bye now.